You need to turn up your vehicle and come out and talk to us. New revelations tonight from Devon Bass, the former NFL player now living in the Valley. A traffic stop turned into a SWAT standoff at his house. And after we got the video today, we asked him what happened. And he had a lot to say to ABC 15's John Erickson, who's live tonight in Gilbert. John, he was pretty upfront with you. Steve, he talked about his mental health and says it wasn't good the night of all of this. I asked him if the new diagnosis he's telling us about has anything to do with his football days. Are you lusting after those mega millions tonight? Well, here's someone who already hit the jackpot. Devon Bess played in the NFL. Devon Bess with the catch. He isn't afraid to talk about his money. No doubts about that. You feel me? Richmond, California. Okay. But Bess's money didn't solve a thing. The night driving without headlights turned into a SWAT standoff. Here was his mom trying to get him to surrender. You're going to have to come outside, babe, because they're not going to leave. You need help. It all ended with a police dog bite, a trip to jail, and a felony charge. He wouldn't go on camera tonight, but Bess tells me that in the lead up to that night, he feels he was let out of a mental health facility too soon. He also says on that night he was off his meds. He also says that since then he's been diagnosed as bipolar. I asked if he apologizes to police for all that happened. He says absolutely. We asked if all those hits during his six seasons in the NFL and college before that could have led to his mental struggles. He says possibly. And he has been indicted on one felony charge in connection with that night here in Gilbert. He has pleaded not guilty, guys. Thanks so much, John.